Hello everyone. So in this video, let us see how to use a packed bar chart when you have many number of categorical variables and one continuous variable. So this example, uh, the data that I'm using is called an S&P 500 index. It can be easily obtained by just Google searching S&P 500 financial information. So the main variables of interest here are companies. Uh, there are 500 different companies, which is a categorical variable and also market cap for each of these companies. So to plot the packed bar chart, you open up graph builder from graph. And then uh, here uh, you drag companies as a Y variable and market cap as an X variable. So by default, you see this scatter plot here, but then this can be changed into a packed bar chart by clicking on bar. So now this graph over here as it is, is a standard uh, uh, bar plot. But however, since there are find a number of companies, you can see that uh, this plot here is kind of not clearly visible and this is not providing any useful information. So in order to change this to a packed bar chart, you change the bar style over here to packed from this list here. So now uh, you can see that uh, the packed bar chart is more uh, uh, useful uh, because you can clearly see the companies and uh, their market cap, at least the top few companies can be clearly seen over here. Further, uh, you can color these companies based on the sector by dragging the sector uh, as a color variable here. So now from this colored uh, packed bar chart, you can see that uh, in the top 10 companies, five of them are from the information technology sector. So once you're done uh, to finish up, you can just click done uh, to obtain the packed bar chart.